Why, hello there, friends. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. My name is Broomstick88, also known as MJ. You can check me out on Instagram, at Broomstick88, and on Snapchat now, at Broomstick88. Like, everybody. You can find me everywhere. There. Just one name to rule them all. Like the ring. Um, so... I'm gonna be doing this, which I was gonna be like, bam, bam, color, and then I was like, bam, bam, I'm having a love affair with this Essence Nude palette, and this Wet n Wild Marina palette, and this Wet n Wild Hieroglyphic Heart palette, and oh, the thing, this highlighter, this Wet n Wild Sweetest Bling highlighter, whoo, it's all over my face right now, and I love it. So really the only thing I went crazy on is I just matched my brows to my hair, so that they, they are also green and blue and brown, and um, stay tuned because we're doing some fun makeup today. Thank you. The first thing we need to do is prime my face to get rid of some of this redness. I'm using the Sheer Envy Lift and Firm from Hard Candy. This has such a great kind of tacky texture to it. It really holds up and makes my makeup last all day long. I'm using the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Luminous Foundation with a damp beauty blender all over my face. And then I'm going to be going in with the Maybelline Fit Me Stick. And I'm just going to be putting this on the highlight areas of my face where I need a little bit more coverage. I love this super high coverage foundation that has a powder core so it stays nice but you can still blend it with a damp beauty blender. After using a generic Makeup Revolution Prismatic Primer on my eyes, I'm going to be going in with some of the coolest palettes I've worked with lately. I am absolutely obsessed with these Essence News and then the Spring Collection from Wet n Wild, which includes the Holographic Heart Palette and the Marina Be Mine Palette. The first shade I'm going to be using is this super pinky nude color out of the Holographic Heart Palette. And I'm going to put this all over my entire crease, all the way out down to the tape to create a winged edge. Then using this gold color from the same palette, I'm going to highlight my brow bone. Now using this taupey nude color from the Essence Palette, I'm going to bring this on the inner corner of my eyes and just sweep it out a little bit before I go in with this really pretty marina blue shade. And I'm gonna be tapping that on the outer corner of my eye, as well as on the inner corner of my eye. I started my liner using my Infallible Paints liner and I just didn't like it as much as I absolutely love my old standby, the Milani iTech. So when I first tried out the L'Oreal Infallible Paints um, felt liner, I was like, nothing will ever replace this. This is God. Thank you, heaven and Carmen above. Um, and then I got these Milani Eye Techs and I was like, yeah, no. And I just tried it because I was like, oh, I forgot about this. I love this one. And I'm like, this is not even compare, like not even compare to the Milani Eye Techs. Like nothing wings like these do. They should just call these the Milani Eye Tech doves because they wing. Get it? They wing like a dove because it's a bird. Like that bird and those other two birds. After making sure that my NYX liner is super duper sharp, I'm gonna go in and do my upper and lower water lines. This is gonna really make my eyes super, super dramatic and I love the drama. Speaking of drama, we're gonna take a little bit of the Glow All The Way highlighter from NYX and tap that on the inner corners and throw a little bit more highlight over the top of it. This is the Wet n Wild Sweetest Bling and I'm obsessed with it. I use it with almost every look. I wear it every single day. I'm going to have to buy a second one because if it's limited edition, I'm going to blow right through this. Now that my brows are on, I'm going to go in with my highlighter, starting with a liquid gold highlighter to give a damp base for my powder highlight to make it extra extreme. These are both drugstore products, one by NYX, and then the Sweetest Bling highlighter you saw me using a few seconds ago. Mm -hmm. 
Using the Kat Von D Shade and Light Dual Blush, I'm going to be going in and tapping a little bit higher up on my cheeks than I would normally put my blush to give myself a natural flush. I'm going to pop in with my favorite nude. This is Melted Chihuahua from Too Faced. It is the absolute best nude pinky tone I've ever found for my skin tone, and I absolutely love it. A little life hack for you guys. A lot of times when you buy like starter kit false lashes, they come with this little... It's like a tweezer, but he's curved and he has a little pusher thing. You can use this for the coolest trick ever, which is where you grip your lashes just like this. Because it's so gentle, it grabs a bunch of them, so you're not going to pull any out. Lift your eye up, and then you can tight line in there. And you can do this for the bottom lashes too. If you have long enough bottom lashes to grip, grab. You can go in with your tight lining and that way you're not pulling on your foundation to get your eyes up or putting finger marks in your eyeshadow. But this little guy is worth like a million bucks. He's fantastic. I'm almost done. I am going to grab a little bit more of that Hieroglyphic Heart Wet n Wild Spring Collection palette. That pinky crease color is life. I think it's so fabulous. I'm going to snag just a little edger brush here and do some of this underneath as well. By the way, I'm doing all of this to go to CVS. Cause it's fun. And why not? Also, if you get a chance to pick up the Wet n Wild uh, Sweetest Bling highlighter, it's their spring highlighter, holy bejesus, it is so, so pretty. It's time to douse myself in my Urban Decay Chill Setting Spray. It is absolutely my favorite, but really you could use any setting spray. I just like the losting effects of this one as well as the cooling effects. I keep winking at you guys so much. I just like to wink, it's fun. You know, I'm gonna skip falsies today. Let's let my hair down and uh, go use our ex extra bucks, which are expiring today. I put in a calendar card for that shit. And I do have more green in my hair than normal because St. Patrick's Day is tomorrow. St. Patrick's Day, it's my favorite holiday next to Halloween. So excited, so excited, so excited. I hope you guys are excited too. But one of the things that I'm most excited for is that you came back to watch another one of my videos. Thank you. Um, that bird who's been silent, 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 for the entire video has just decided to start talking. So um, I am going to put on just a little bit more nose highlight because I just really freaking like this highlighter. He's so cute. Don't hate on the nose highlight. Who doesn't love a nose highlight? I got it distracted. I am like the most distracted person in the world. Um, thank you for coming back. I really appreciate it. If you like this look, if you try out this look, if it's just something that you stop by to hang out with me, thank you. Appreciate it. Um, and cool stuff is happening because I am in the next like day or so going to be announcing the golden giveaway spring, two th spring uh, winter 2017 winner because I picked her. And I'm going to put you, let you know on Instagram at Broomstick88 because I love you guys. Thank you for coming back. If you guys can't stand to miss another moment of Broomstick88, please check me out on Instagram and on Snapchat at Broomstick88, just like it's spelled here. Thanks, guys. And it was great to see you again.